Good morning, I'm David Wood for Bag Up TV and we're on our way to the third round of the UK Angling Championship. We are on our way to Rookery Waters. So, let's get down there and smash them up today. Come on! And I don't feel no shame, it's a mood you lack I go crazy, nah, I ain't lazy Track after track, I work on this shit daily Pass me the jack, right as fuel got me hazy About to unpack all these shit I've been crazy Well, I was that hungry I forgot to take a picture of my breakfast <laughs> But, there we go All finished And look at Nosha He's even had his hair done for occasion Nicked his lasses, uh, glasses so we're just having breakfast and then we're ready for the big interview, aren't we, Tidza? I can't wait. I cannot wait. Round three, I'm talking, I'm having a chat with Jamie Hughes. He's brilliant, I want Jamie. See how he's doing. Oh well, you watch. I'll right. talk to anyone, Nosh. Hey, yeah. Jamie, I'm the mightiest. It's a rookery waters. New place for some of you, uh, old oh, place for others. Uh, I must say it's a fantastic lake, it's a fantastic fishery. There will be some big weights around the complex today. Alex has assured me that. Uh, you all know how good it is here. Uh, rules wise, four keep nets. Split your fish evenly between the four nets. Open as that, Terry, please. Absolute flyer. Oh. Uh, magpie. Right, so we've done the draw. I'm on peg 27 on magpie. And um, I'm waiting for Nosha after we've just done the draw. And I'm like, where are you? Where are you? What are you doing? I ain't seen him all. I had breakfast with him and then he's just gone and sodded off somewhere. So I don't know if he's a bit nervous. That all the lads were winding up about this big interview for, uh, for Jamie. Harrison, not Harrison, Jamie Hughes, the big interview for Jamie Hughes that he's uh, preparing. So I don't know where he is. He's like, I mean, he's lost. It's like, where's Waller? Where's Nosher? I don't know where he is. So anyway, I'm going to get to my peg now and uh, I'll let you know what it's like. Hopefully we'll have a chat with Nosher at the end if I can find him, but who knows where he is? Where's Waller? <laughs>
right, here we are, pack 27. We're all set up. Got all my top kit set up. A couple of shallows, a couple of jiggers, a couple of mugging rigs, uh, a couple of edge rigs as well. But I've got all them tied up, plus some extra in there. If I don't, if I start cracking off and it doing me head in, losing loads of fish, then I've got my method rod that I'm just going to chuck out as well. Uh, plan is cast a shallow, hopefully mug a few, shallow, shallow, shallow really, and then edges later on, down there, down here, that's the plan. Uh, so I've got all my top kits set up, my rod, using the uh, XZ65 World Elite 16 meter pole, really nice kit that is, um, it's about four foot all the way uh, and then the edge is about three foot um, so not too much depth but if you want to draw a peg then this is it in it Richard Drog there Ben over there Diago around that corner Mac um, yeah but there's four us well there's pretty much five us all in this like bay area here but Everyone said it's a flyer, so we'll see, won't we? Got a bit of ground mate mixed up, and then I've just got casters and then pellets, uh, and then I've got some worms for down hedge. Um, so that's it. That's the peg, that's the setup. So we'll see what happens.
All right. Seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But all will be okay I move on each and every day 
The past is where it stays Way back a year ago I've changed for the better this time I thought I would never be fine I strive just to say I'm alright And for the first time in a long time I'm alright I've seen a lot of change Been through a lot of pain Some things are not the same As they were a year ago But all will be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago
Let's go, Alex the bin. <laughs> quickly, quickly. <laughs> Cheers, Alex. Cheers, Alex. Thanks for that. Thanks for that, mate. Enjoy. Look at all these stuff you've got for him and all. You know. Oh, he'll, he's going to screw when he opens that, you know. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> well, I hope, uh, I hope you've all enjoyed it, Rookery. Uh, I'm sure... Uh, Alex and the fishery staff a bit first to say it's not fish to its true potential today, but we still had some fantastic weight. So, uh, brilliant. A couple of thank yous. I'd like to thank Alex and uh, his dad, Tim, and, and all the staff here. He, uh, what a fishery it is. It's absolutely fantastic. And I'm sure you'll want another round here next year, guys, mate. So, uh, anyway, start with sections. Right, section A, second. Second with 186 pounds, Chris Vanderfleet. Well 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 and your winner of that section with 198.6, John Arthur. He's gone. Get him ready for fish show. He's psyching his drawing arm up. <laughs> uh, uh, section B, second with 153.8, Chris Young. Yeah, and the winner of that section with 156.12, Matt Linford. Well, well done, Matt. Well done, buddy. Well done, Matt. <coughs> section C. Well done, first with 191 pound 10, Jimmy Brooks. Go on. Well done, Jimmy. And second. With a hundred and ninety pounds eight ounces, Jamie Hughes. Section D, Crow. Second, hundred and fifty seven pound eight, Dave Verley. And your winner with a hundred and ninety six fourteen, Danny Crow. Go on, Danny. Hold on, Dan. Hold on, Dan. E section Raven second with 123.12. Billy Marlow. Yeah. And your winner with 183.15. Nick Spade. Well done. Andrew, Sunday name. Let me man calls me that or when I'm in trouble. Uh, F section. Raven again, second, 131.10, Jeff Wiseman. Go on, Jeff. And your winner from that section and new leader for this year, before we've checked the points, new leader with 149.4, Tom Calladine. Go on, Tom. Go on, Tom. With 140 pounds, 14 ounces, Alex Doherty. I'll say that. It's, uh, it's four times default. Four times default. Four times. Four times. Four times. Four times. Four times. And the winner of that section, yeah, three times default, uh, Richard Dridge, 185 1. 
Which leads us on to our top three on the day. And in third place, collecting 250 quid, David Wood. Yay, go on with it. With a weight of 200 and six pounds one ounce. Well Cheers, man. In second place. Now, our next to his mate today, and he said he got 130 pounds, but he's actually weighed 248.15, collecting 500 quid. Tyler Bird. Wow, well done, man. Uh, you see, you're absolutely. He said he got 500 quid. And your winner on the day, I knew it won't be long, I give him a grand every year. <laughs> every year I give him at least a grand. I think I gave him four grand last year. But today's winner with a weight of £264.9, ounces, current, current UK champion, Stephen Forster. Well done, Steve. You're going to get a bigger mantelpiece for them trophies. <laughs> Here we go, guys. Thanks, for it. Right, well, we finished the match. We're in the van. Uh, we've just done the presentation. I'm sorry, throughout the match, I didn't do much talking because... Well, my glasses are a right mess. Um, I've been busy catching, to be honest. Um... And my battery started running out on both cameras and I thought I'm not getting up to change them, I need to concentrate on the match. One of the biggest matches a year. Um and unfortunately, so I do apologise that there probably isn't enough footage. There's not really much talking or anything like that because I drew an absolute flyer at the start. And I've weighed in two hundred and six pounds three ounce or something like that. And I've ended up coming third in the match. So we've got another UK champs check. There you go, look, another check. Uh, no trophy this time, but I've really enjoyed that. And all I've done is fish a jigger up against them lily pads, as you saw in the video. Um, and I've just been spraying casters in. I've gone through eight pints of casters and just sprayed them in, sprayed them in. Um, yeah, and it's been a really nice day, to be honest. Uh, I should have had more because I've cracked off loads of times, lost loads of rook lengths, um, lost about three jiggers as well, just in the weeds and everything like that. It was just one of them pegs where you knew you were going to lose a lot of gear, and I was prepared for that, but I weren't prepared for it, if you know what I mean. So I'd set three jiggers up, three shallow rigs and, and this and that, but then... I started losing them all and losing up lengths and, and losing jiggers and elastic snapped on one just because of the wear and tear really and just the amount as soon as the hook one I'm bullying it trying to get it away from them lilies so it don't go in um, <clears throat> and I've just been trying to get them in as fast as I can but young Tyler he was to the left of me um, and he's had 140, uh, 240 pounds so he's come second in the match. And then further down, Stephen, Stephen Forster, he's had £245, I think, and he's won the match. And to be honest, today I should have done that because it were only £40. Um, and for the last sort of half an hour, I've cracked off on all my jiggers, all my shallow kits. Um, and I've probably only put like three fish in the net in the last sort of half an hour, which I'm a little bit gutted about because I should have... I had a chance there today to win it again, but I'm not complaining. Um, I've done well, and I've I've come third in the match, so it's always nice to uh, to do. Um, and like I said, that's it. Just fish the jigger all day, and then once that's gone dead, I've tried on the bottom and had a couple of fish on the bottom, then just gone back to the jigger because it was miles better and just sprayed casters in. So very simple match to be honest, but. Could have done better. Anyway, so well done to the framers. Well done to Steve. He's absolutely awesome. Well done to young Tyler. He's had a really good day catching uh, loads of fish as well. And then I've just pipped... Um, who did I pip? I think it was Jimmy Brooks had 190 summer. So I've just pipped him to third. So fantastic day. 
I said to Nosh around me, you've done well, aren't you? You've done well. And then he's just gone. Not 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 stayed around for his best mate, has he? Winning some money. So, uh, yeah, a bit... Um, I don't know, Nosh. Yeah. You, you say you don't get the face on, but he's got the face on and gone. So that's it. That's what I've got to say. I've well. found him anyway. <laughs> anyway. Hello. So, at the end of the UK Champs, he ended up running off. No, I did not. Because... I said to him, are we right going to do a video? I don't know, I don't know where he gets all this shit. I said, are we going to finish it video? Um, I've it. gone, I've gone, I've gone. Are you going to fish, fish it video? Oh, finish. It's been a long day, mate. I know it has. So, uh, so, this is the UK Angling Championship end video anyway, but it is a different day. Alan's it just is. ruined it for him. Well, we're right, we had a nice journey down. That was a lovely journey. It was an easy journey oh, down. Yeah, we're all nice right down. Nice breakfast. Yeah. Thought, well, that's a doddle on way back. Yeah. We'll mention that one later. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Terrible, weren't it? God, Bennett. Yes, so we're there. And if you remember on the previous UK champs, I've said, he said, Jamie Hughes has won the match and I've gone, yeah, but he's brilliant though, Jamie, isn't he? And he's absolutely milked it to death. Round three, I'm talking, having a chat with Jamie Hughes. He's brilliant though, isn't he, Jamie? See how he's doing. All I, the lads. I also mentioned. Got you, didn't I, Yeah, they did. It primed everybody. Because I've never I've never actually spoke to Jamie Hughes, and I said, next time, next time at UK Champs, I'll go and have a chat with him. Which I did, he didn't believe me, but I did out of his way <laughs> <laughs> i never saw it well neither did any of the lads you know when i went to pay for me at pools for uk champs while waiting for his breakfast yeah he just turned up just got out of his van as i was walking back and i introduced myself he already knew me yeah <laughs> you know you went all day did he yeah you know you went all was that and it looked like he just got out of bed and had a three-hour drive so i really didn't want to bother him but he turned around and he knows what the crack is he says don't worry al he says, we'll sort some out just as I've drawn my peg. Well done, Jamie. And? He laughs me off. <laughs> <laughs> so he's pegging off. But to Do be you know what? I'd have done the same. It, well, he would. He definitely would. But oh. to be fair to the lad, I'm not holding anything against him. He's there to win the UK champs. He's been saying, you can't wait for the big interview. You've primed all oh. that. I haven't primed anyone. They were, they were, I, oh. I got there and there were Jeff. Tids there and all them like the team video, aren't they? And they yeah. were ones what were giving it large. Oh I, I just God. come up, I was just like, yeah, right. non stop barrage for about an hour. Yeah, <laughs> just won't leave you alone. Uh, that's why he'd gone off. I would have gone off and all, God, but uh, but he's, yes. there, he's, he's there to win the UK champs anyway, isn't he? so he's taking it pretty serious. Fair play to the lad. Yeah, I'm know. sure I'll have a chat with him next time round. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. He couldn't leave it, could he? He could not leave it. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Gonna put you, my foot in it. Yeah, you, you you, that was just plain sailing there. Yeah, he's there to win UK <laughs> chaps, don't worry. I'm going to uh, give him something it, to giggle about, it, folks. On, I'll tell you. On day after, he's, gonna, he's at Fishermania, so leave him be. I said to him, leave him be, Alan. Don't worry about this big interview you packed. You no, said, you oh. bloody thing. <laughs> and, uh, in fact, there's a clip of him butting in going, so when's big interview? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I take it, mate. You don't bother me. Um, so anyway, by the time that we'd weighed in and everything, it was about half past seven, and he's ringing me on phone. Where are you? I'm in, I'm in car park waiting for you. I, I didn't realise it was that late. I rang you twice, didn't well, I? Yeah, yeah. And, and I was like, I haven't still... weighed in yet. I was still weighing in, you so, know. It was half past seven, 25 to eight, and I'd just had enough. I was knackered. I'd got eight nets in, and I was one. Well, yeah, right. And then the aquarium, that. So anyway, I've ended up weighing 206 pounds. I didn't think I had that. I thought I had about 180, and everyone's, what you got, what you got? And I'm in the same section as Tidze as well, and, and he's coming up, what you got? I says, what you got? He says, oh, I've got 120. I says, oh, it's going to be close. <laughs> anyway, Tidze, <laughs> were, the typical Tidze were well up there in the leaderboard. Yeah, they were. And uh, you should have seen his face when I weighed in. Bloody hell. He wanted, he, he, were, he were gunning for me. His face, whoa. Yeah, like that, old Tidza. Uh, yeah, you've had a good day, day. That's yeah. uh, it's cracking, and it's turned out first, second, and third have all come off that area yeah. where you where you yeah. are. Yeah. So, so you... Tyler comes second with 
two two thirty or two forty, yeah. and then Steve, Steve Forster, Forster has won it. Has won it with two hundred and sixty, and he drew the same peg as Ben Townsend, you know, on that point. Oh, yeah. um, so I've ended up I've ended up coming third in the match, but I've also ended up coming third in the section as well, uh, which. I'd I'd prefer it's to come third in match, obviously, because yeah, yeah. you get you, you get, get more money, don't you? Yeah. So I had a nice hey, check. Listen, you can't nice complain picture. with that. You've you've got two hundred pound. That's fantastic, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. That so later. I'd weighed in right quick, and my phone's ringing, and Alan's there, and and who do you want to tell? You know, as soon as you've done well in the match. Anyway, I I, I got in my van and I went straight to 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 cafe bit. You know where they do. Uh, you know, presentation, I thought, Alan will be here, he'll be there waiting for, like this, old Alan with his <laughs> you hands out. I, I wanted to just go up and give him an high five, high five and a yeah. big hug and say, yeah, Ding. I've done it like this. <laughs> and uh, I looked at my phone and I thought, oh, what's this, a message from Alan? And I, and I clicked on it like that and it, it says, gone home, fed up, waiting. <laughs> thought, All right, Alan, thanks. You, cheers, mate, you and my best I didn't, mate. I told him. It's, it's... <laughs> Okay, I'll let you off. <laughs> so uh, yeah, he'd gone off, hadn't he? So anyway, I went back and uh, did the results, and yeah, it were it were good. I'll put the results up for you now, and you can have a look. So great. Anyway, man. that's great, that's well, the glory well, post. Isn't well, that's it? the glory post. Alan, how did you get on? Crap! Can we leave it at that? Oh man. Right. Well, I got uh, I got tanked, basically. Well, that's about as much as I want to talk about that, Dave. Crap. Well, I'd got a prize to give out, and I, because it's the UK champs, we're giving out the uh, MIDI compactor. I've got another one of these, so I'll give another one out on this video as well. So if you want to win this again on the next video, which is the last round at Barston, Barston Lakes, just comment on this video and um, you will get to win a method feeder mold and method feeder the midi compactor uh, we've got also got one to give out and uh, i've scrolled through the comments and i picked this one out uh, it's from liam parkinson 7538 love it dave you and nosha crack me up our little one has just received her stickers from midi for her seat box so she can be like you so <laughs> uh, liam parkinson Send me an email at baguptv at gmail.com and I'll send you the method feeder and mould out. Well done, Liam Parkinson. So, uh, yes, thank you for all the comments. Over 310 comments on Brilliant. that video. So thank you very much for Brilliant. commenting. And if you want to win it again, because I've got another one, just comment on this video and you can win it again. Good idea that. I might start doing something like that myself. There we go. Copying again. Got to do, not you? Good idea, though, isn't it? So... That's the end of that one, Alan. UK champs, brilliant for you. Disaster for me. Oh, it's my my thing. This UK champs, isn't it? But I'm ready, re read up for Barston now. Ready, ready to go. I wonder if we'll draw next to each other again. I hope not. <laughs> I hope not. He'll only come over, can't you know me, snap? I might take some egg sandwiches. Oh, yeah. He likes that, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. I said to him, what sandwiches you got today? He says, oh, cress. Said, oh, <laughs> cress, it's chicken. Bloody hell. Chicken sandwiches. Um, yeah, that were nice, that egg sandwich. It were a big, big thing and all, weren't it? Yeah, at so. it. Yeah. Anyways, talking about food, I'm absolutely bloody starving, me. We've had a great long day today, haven't we? Yeah. Um, so, oh, on that drive home. What, oh, what the drive a, home from the UK champs. That was. So just over two hours to get there, and over three hours to get back. But you know what? God, Bennett. I weren't that too disappointed, no, because I in in my spare seat just there, I had a big check. You know, big UK champs check just sat there. I just wanted like, to go see uh, my mummy. <laughs> <laughs> say no more. <laughs> <laughs> so that's it thank you very much for watching this one hope you've enjoyed it and um, we'll see you at the next round of the UK champs which is at Barson in a couple of weeks Alan not too far along oh, I quite like it at Barson um, I've been so, for a while have we no Barson. well enjoy that can't wait for that one I've moved up the leaderboard yes. the only way is up baby
It's oh. you and me now. The only way is up. And this then for the, Alan, this is it's the, this is the down, down, deeper and down, <laughs> down, down, deeper and yeah. down. This is the best mode you will ever see. Him in. Yeah. Well, I just just won it again, Alan, haven't we? Yeah. Brilliant. So. so don't forget, folks. It is absolutely free to subscribe to these channels. If you click the notification bell, you'll get all these videos as we upload them. And a thumbs up would be very, very nice. Also, you can send us a super thanks in the comments section of these videos. Uh, it's a new thing, so you can just pop on there, uh, click the super thanks button and send a donation in if you want to. It is very much appreciated. Yes. Every little helps. Yes. It's like Tesco's, isn't it? Is that Tesco or Asda? Oh no, as they were the ping ping. Yeah, I mean, it's Tesco, yeah. isn't it? So, yeah. yeah, so thank you very much, folks. And uh, we shall see you. Don't know where we are next, do we? we no, know it's no idea. Next, next round, but don't know where we are next, but we'll see you on the bank, wherever it may be. Take care, folks, and don't forget to keep on bagging and fishing. Fight, never quit, do it right, play the game, win it life, have no shame. Hey guys, thanks for tuning on the video. If you want to see more videos, hit this awesome playlist down here. Make sure you hit the subscribe button, and if you want to become a member, hit the join button. Thanks for watching the video, guys. We'll see you soon. Keep on bagging.